In this video, we're gonna walk through the top five AI features on Google's brand new Pixel 8 phone. Let's check out this advertisement for the phone and highlight some of these awesome, awesome features. So it starts out with this guy, he's in the middle of a city, he's gonna record some video of himself dancing, of course. But watch, he hits pause and he's able to easily manipulate himself using the magic photo eraser. Next, we look at this couple that are out in a very windy area and they use the audio magic eraser to eliminate background noise. How cool is that? Super, super interesting. You'll also see that you're able to easily unblur photos. Super cool. This is actually a really, really neat feature. Best take. You're able to... I, I just got to stop here for a minute because this is so wild. If you're anything like me and you've ever taken group photos and you can see here that these two people are just making not the best faces, what you can do is you can take five, six, ten different photos and you're able to move your faces around watch this watch how crazy this is boom boom you're able to take that one like for me especially having a kid there's always times where one of my kids is blinking or making a weird face well now by taking a burst of photos i'm able to get a great shot every single time how dope is that super super cool Next, he uses his magic editor. Watch this. This is a really cool tool. Boom. You're able to eliminate the trampoline while this guy is slam dunking. You might say, Mark, this doesn't seem like that revolutionary. And you know what? You're right to an extent. You could have paid a photo editor hundreds, if not thousands of dollars to create these custom images. But the AI makes it so easy because what AI is able to do is you're able, it's able to rem remove these features. And then based on all the other pixels, it's able to determine, okay, this is probably what's going on behind the scenes, making it seamless and simple for everyday people just like you and me to manipulate photos instantly. Super, super, super cool. Now, that's not the end. There's a few other really interesting features that I, that I want to highlight here. So, we've, so now that we've watched the ad and you've kind of seen the hype machine in place here let's go ahead and, and highlight a few more of these features because again we're looking at the top five here uh some of the most interesting exciting we're talking about some of the implications here too so again this is that magic photo editor which i just think is really really cool being able to easily uh, create the most compelling images and you can see here that you just actually select the best face your favorite face that is a, i think a really neat kind of a really weird feature but i think it's really interesting now, this is a really cool feature, too. You're able to change the background. You're able to move where things are actually placed if you want things to be more centered. As a creative person, I think this is really interesting. Um, as a human being, this makes me nervous, though, because you're not going to know what's actually physically real versus digitally real. I mean, you're blurring the lines between what actually happened. And I've talked about this in the past. I talked about it in this video up here. I'll post a link. But... What's real? What's not real? The lines are being blurred and there's a lot of scary ramifications. We talked about the audio editor, which I think is super, super cool. Uh, there's some other things that you can do with this as well, like using the Bard Assistant. Uh, Bard is Google's AI tool, which can summarize websites, videos. It's a conversational chat bot that you can ask questions to, even using your audio. Uh, voice uh, you can it can help you to like recap emails that you may have mixed if you're anyone like me who gets so much emails it can proofread those and kind of help to keep you up to date it can ask you can ask it follow-up questions like where was I supposed to meet Jim or at what time so kind of like an AI assistant not, not kind of like that's exactly what it is an AI assistant uh, they've also added in a proofreading tool which will proofread what you type kind of like a spell check but a little bit more advanced which I think is interesting and the other one uh, the other feature I think that's super super interesting is call screening call screening so when you're getting one of those calls from a spam bot it's going to be able to kind of screen that say hey what's up what do you need no we're not interested yes we are interested and so it's going to be able to kind of screen calls a bit more effectively so some really really cool features here on this google pixel ai phone um the creative stuff is really incredible for someone like me who's creative i'm really into that um but again the lines are being blurred which is something to think about 
And I, I got to say, just having a call screener, AI assistant is really interesting to me. What do you think? What features on here scare you, excite you? Type it in the comments. I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for subscribing. I'll keep you up to date. All right. See ya. Peace.